Hello and welcome back to Dial In for Hero Clicks. Guys, today we're doing a very special brick unboxing of Avengers 60th. We just had our pre-release today. So before we get into the brick, we're just going to go down the line and go over our pre-release teams. Spoiler alert, we had great polls. I was back table. Dude, Stacked. everybody at the table, not even just us, everybody at the table, which is one whole more person. Uh, <laughs> Simeon, go over what you pulled, what you played today. I'm not, yeah, I'm not going to go into everything Nothing I played crazy. because uh, I don't remember all of it. But uh, what I ended up building out of my two boosters was the Super Air Prime Thor. That was the linchpin of my team. Played him at 150 points. Normally, I'd advise against like a big beat stick, but he's a 13 for five on his own combat. He's brutal, man. With impervious yeah. and brutal. shape change. He, spoiler, never got KO'd today. Uh, next up on my team, it was really kind of hard figuring it out, but since Thor doesn't have flight, I was like, well, Ant-Man can make him Yeah, he was just leaping in his skull. No, just yeah, yeah. Just leaping. And the, the non-prime flies, but it's, it's whatever, he's, he's hammer, that's fine. Uh, the common Ant Man can not only make Thor tiny, but also give him flight once oh, yeah. he becomes tiny. Yeah. So oh, yeah, hey. I was like, that's probably going to come into play at least once or twice. And it kind of did. Uh, Misty Knight, we had talked about that in our. Yeah. We're big fans set of yeah. our oh, yeah. set review. She's excellent. She made Thor, every game she made Thor detective, <laughs> at least once every game. She like hit leadership. <laughs> she absolutely came in clutch with the empower or enhancement. Oh, yeah. And then somebody that I didn't realize would work just as well with that Misty Knight as Thor did, maybe even better, was the uncom or the common Captain Marvel, who can switch between a range dial and a close combat dial. I really like her. I so, think she's really solid. Yeah, she has flight. She could carry a Misty, always have like a plus one. Ooh, it's either one. Yeah, because yeah. she's choosing. Yeah. That's so, yeah. Uh, and then, I guess, kind of rounding out the team was I had a sideline war machine. <laughs> it's hilarious. Because Ant-Man yes. has Stark That's Industries so keyword. So the first time or maybe second time uh, that Ant-Man got hit, I had the option to pull in Iron Man. Oh, he got hit. Machine. Yeah, that's funny. Oh, he got hit. Okay. Iron, yeah, Ant-Man actually did get hit a few times. <laughs> oh, At least God. once in our game, too. Yeah. Oh, gosh. After Man. 40 swings. When you give Thor detective, you should just get the crack the case. Oh, like, gosh. <laughs> trade would be yeah. so funny. It really took me back to Earth X, that set. Oh where, my uh, gosh, stop! <laughs> oh, that was Earth X, no, right? Was no! Battle World? This is Battle World! Oh, they're so similar. Yeah, uh, I, hate the you, I hate you guys so much. She's the, the worst. How did your right. games go, though, Simeon? I, uh, I went, uh, spoiler alert, 3 0. Uh, the first game was actually probably one of the closer ones. Um, I can't remember exactly what he was playing. But he played it really conservatively, and it wasn't his first pre-release with this set. So he had, like, Vision. He had a bunch of stuff. Mm. I pulse waved him with Thor's traded pulse wave, like, five times and never got doubles. <sighs> so and so sad. I was just slowly grinding down his dial. And he had the Iron Man that gives all, like, adjacent Avengers mm -hmm. precision strike, which actually meant that he could deal Thor damage. So Thor got down past his, like, start or his second starting line, but not to, like, his bad clicks. And uh, I ended up winning by only 20 points. Oh, that's close. Yeah, wow. Yeah, 175 to 155, because wow. I did call in War Machine, and he did score War Machine. Um, close. My second game, uh, the guy just positioned in a way that I was able to capitalize, and I just nerfed his team. Like, I almost one-shot of the Hammer. I did one-shot of Black Panther. I one-shot Leader the next <laughs> turn. Oh, my and God. And it came down to, like, Monica Chang and Morgan Le Fay. And so it was like, it was like, well, I have a Good full luck. powered Thor and like Good still luck. other stuff on my team. But Leader did scare me for a half second because his improved targeting and mind control. Wild, dude. Just so nasty. Good. Really TK good. Prob, too. He's a, he's a sealed he's dream. That yeah. guy's amazing. And then I, I won't talk about my last game. Game three, Will. Yeah. Yeah, we'll wait for that one. Right. <laughs> it was soft. so easy. It was way too easy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah all right. Yeah. Uh, my team. You lost first. My <laughs> Spoiler. Okay. All right. <laughs> uh, so they shuffled the boosters around, which is why I have two of the same rare, but I was really happy. She's my favorite rare in the set. The first figure we saw preview for the set. So I got to play two Screaming Mimis. One Captain America LMB, the Uncommon Scarlet Witch, the Common Iron Man that gives out the Precision Strike, a 15-point Hydra agent to round out the team, and then my my super rare, my good pull, uh, is Moonstone for the team. It was a lot of fun. So it was just kind of Moonstone and her and her girls would just run up there and they'd be, ah, scream, pulse wave, ah, scream, pulse wave, and just stay adjacent to you the whole time. So they got 
you know, 18 combat reflexes staying adjacent to you, 12 attack pulse waves, pulse waving you. It's a ton of fun. Uh, nimble, being able to say I'm going to nimble, I'm going to nimble, brought me back. Uh, uh, I heard that and I was I like, because I played against one in round one. Nimble. Like, hmm. Nimble. Yeah. Well, power's nimble. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Seven years. <laughs> seven, seven. I never even uh, knew what it did. Yeah, uh, Captain America LMD was a ton of fun. The Iron Man was a ton of fun. Uh, I really enjoyed this team. I played Moonstone at full, so whenever she got knocked down to her first stop, the Mimis could pulse wave with her in the pulse wave, and she wouldn't take any damage because it oh, stopped in bone. Nice. That was like a lot of fun. Uh, but the first game was pretty good. I had to play against that little rare Prime Hulk, and he healed like instantly right away. But after a while, I was able to just get the pulse waves in. Getting LMD cap onto his flurry click and then Iron Man next to him for the precision oh, strike was really dang, good in that okay, game too. Okay. Like, so yeah, that was fun. So I won that game. I love that cap. Yeah, I'm really, shield TA I'm enjoying it. Oh, dude, the shield TA came in clutch one game. Moonstone yeah. copied it so she could uh, see it's a shame further. that he's better than like yeah. a lot of real caps. Sadly, yeah. yeah. Like for 30 points, what he does is really it's good. Shame. Um, so that was a ton of fun. First game, I won W, uh, wiped the whole team. Second game didn't didn't do so hot. There's like no reducers on this team, and this little idiot kid Thanos just bat, bat, yeah. bat, 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 blew up everybody really Luke hard. Luke was the the fourth person yeah, on the table. Dude. You guys have seen him in a few videos. He pulled the kid Thanos and then the rare Doctor Strange. This figure's amazing and sealed. Mm. So Calder had to go against it his was team. Tough. He also, also had the super rare Miss Marvel. He also pulled two bats, and then he pulled an Ultron with an Ultron drone in the same pack. He pulled that hole, which is tough to take out. Hulk, yeah. yeah. Uh, no, the, the entire beginning of the game, before we started, I was just making, like, jokes, like, you know, Miss Marvel died in comics, so she's going to die in this she game. Gonna, she was the only thing that died uh, on his team that game. I, I made sure to kill her right away. Don't worry, comic fans. I'm nothing but comic gotcha. accurate. Yeah. So we, we slaughter Miss Marvel, and then it's like, ah, shoot, and Kid Thanos, bat, Hulk, bash, and I was like, this sucks. Yeah. So I lost that game. And then my last game was against Korvac, Beyonder, and Thanos, all at 100 wow. points. Wow. Which was really, really tough, actually. Uh, the amount of stop clicks, rollouts, prob, all so that much jazz. So invincible, too. A lot man. of it. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I remember the time in comics it's when old. a robot Captain America, Iron Man, Screaming Mimi took down Korvac, the Beyonder, and <laughs> Thanos. And we did. And we, we beat him in that beat game. Him for lunch. It was <laughs> wild. Again, the Mimi is pulse waving, and just that little nimble. I wish it was sidestep, but the fact that it's nimble does make yeah. me really happy, and it's really fun. Yeah. Uh, them pulse waving the. Hydra agent just running shot next to Iron Man. Oh, two damage. That's terrible. He's got precision strike now. So bap, he shot Korvac. Like I bet that was times. That game. It was. Yeah. It was really big. So again, copying shield whenever I needed it, or copying whatever. Captain America also got beyond her off. That's actually a lie. Uh, he got beyond her two with stop clicks. Screaming Mimi is somewhere in here. She goes to just like force. Yeah, force blast. So he got her to force blast beyond her last two stop clicks. He has no it's reducer. Regen, right? So she nimbled. Yeah. Kicked him into the wall, nimbled again, kicked him into the wall next turn, and killed Beyonder. It was really funny. Uh, and that's how my game That's how it happened in the comics. Like yeah, exactly. Yeah, Screaming Mimi just kind of kicked Beyonder into the wall twice yeah. and he died, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, so that's how Secret Wars ends. Like, yeah. yeah. He's like, I am almighty. I'm everything. Like, she goes, but walls and bah. hurt. Bah. <laughs> yeah. Well, All yeah. right, Ian, tell us about your team. Very green uh, team. Yeah, mine will be quick. Uh, so I pulled the Doom Supreme, which was one of my top ones for the set. Absolutely loved Doom. He was a ton of fun to play. I also got the Militant with mm. 19 Defend, who was big time. Like, having a 19 was great. Except when you have to play against Pulse Wave. <laughs> what could that be? Uh, Bowman, the common that we all just celebrated so much on the podcast. Did he, did he perform how we Dude, thought? Yeah, he did yeah. like 20 damage today. Yeah. The boy popped off. The Hydra team abilities to drop people's defense. Like, I didn't have any perplex out with a prop, but I had Hydra, and that paid off big time. And then I also had the 100 point Thanos. I also pulled Beyonder, but looking at his 100 point dial, I was like, this guy kind of sucks. Like, yeah, he had prob. But uh, Thanos yeah, just had so much more staying power. Yeah, and I didn't copying realize copying the powers is copying really a nice. power from somebody that hit him. That last turn. Good. Like, yeah, that, sometimes it was just lock. like really you don't have an option. But there was like decent choices a yeah. lot. Like he was stealing. Uh, I like, got I some problems from but... that. I got oh, okay. like a, you know sidestep when I needed it, running shot when I needed it. Uh, I picked up an energy explosion one time, which helped out big time. Um, but yeah, like the first game was an absolute slaughter. I played against Blake, so if you're watching this, hey Blake, sorry about that. Uh, yeah, there's like really bro. nothing to talk about there. Like the opening, opening turn, 
I mean, he'll agree with me. He perplexed up his defense. He runs out. I pulse wave him to get rid of the perplex. Uh, roll doubles. Uh, go up with Bowman. Penetrating psychic blast. Doubles again. Ooh. Just bash, bash. Oh. Pull up with uh, Thanos for the last hit. Roll a critical hit. And I'm just like, I'm like, dude, this was already an uphill battle. But yeah, so it was just, I mean, it was wow, over when I put the team dead. down. It was over after the first string of attacks. Game two. Very similar story. Played against the Thanos at full, along with okay. uh, Tactical Force and the Spider Robot. Okay. So rough forty points. That is really rough. Very uh, easy to KO for he's, he's, he's interesting if you already have like a robot on the team. And he can do his I, thing. I was at yeah. The only robot I have mean, there's was, a place like, for him. Rasta, but see the place points, though. Forty points, three clicks. You're basically just Rob. Yeah. yeah. And so that game was also just like you know I pulled up. I pulse waved his Thanos over and over because I didn't want him really in shape change. Uh, there was a few instances where Thanos used out wit. I'm like, are you sure? And mm. he goes, you know what? I'm good. A few instances yeah. with prop where it's like, do you want to prop that? Actually not good. You know, because it's like I get to remove a token. I get to use the power that he used or I get to heal a click. And when you have like six clicks of invincible, like two clicks of invincible impervious, yeah. you don't want me healing at all. So that was like huge. And then, yeah, game three, I played against Simeon. How many times did I use Outwitter? You had none on your team. <laughs> <laughs> I built... That's hilarious. I built Simeon with, like, tied me up with Ant-Man, dude. Oh, tied me up with Ant-Man? Oh, These guys tried Ant -Man? to hit Ant-Man, like, 30 times, and Ant-Man's just like... Well, was, actually, my guy's just doing this. <laughs> well, probably the... Like, I, I won't give myself great too game, much though, credit man. in that game. Ian's opening attack should have, like, crippled my team. Uh, he hit with Doom's Pulse Wave and then missed two follow-up attacks that should have hit. And I, mean, then, I rolled a three and he yeah. did, what, sixes? Yeah. yeah. And I, I immediately tied up uh, Bowman and Militant with Ant-Man. I was like, I don't know what Ant-Man's doing this game, but he's at least going to keep these two off my He bag. did work, dude, because I was like, man, I if because it's like my situation out of the game. was it's like, if I roll for Breakaway and I running shot, I'm going to be shooting at Prime Thor, who I have minus one attack against, or minus one damage against. Mm -hmm. He's also ESD, so it's just like, I need like a 10 to hit this That's guy. Tough. So it's like, okay, I'll just punch Ant-Man. Never roll an 8. And then Militant finally hit him at the That's end funny. when it just did not matter. Yeah. But then... A big moment in the game. Yeah. I, I'm thinking the game's over. My alpha went horribly. Simeon's got my whole team in pulse wave range. It's looking brutal. He's hitting big willpowers. I pull up with Doom, running shot pulse wave, hit a crit. Knock back his Misty Ooh. Knight, kill her. Did three damage to Put your Captain, Captain Marvel. Marvel on her last click at that point. Yeah, Which would have been one more attack. Yeah. Like, oh, gosh, it could have been a different story, but... Simeon ended up pulling it out. We were back and forth for a while there. It was really close. Yeah, you got uh, you got Thor down to his last click. Oh, then that, I missed steel my energy, attack. Man. Yeah, I missed my attack with steel energy against Doom. Doom had to clear, and then I hit the second. I needed like an eight. Yeah, he needed the like eight, ten dude. Ten for four, and I was Rolled able to exactly the eight. And, oh, yeah. and then uh, also we came into a fun interaction when uh, it's not oh, fun. That's funny. It's not fun. When Ian hit the <laughs> man. My War Machine finally came in, and he Pulse Wave War Machine, and War Machine's sideline active ability is not uh, protected Pulse Wave, oh. so normally when he would take damage, instead of taking damage, you remove him from the game, but since it's not protected Pulse Wave, uh, we just kind of ruled it that uh, he's going to stay in the game and take one damage. That needs, uh, uh, if that's actually how it works, which we all agreed it is, Yeah, that needs to be changed. Like that's It has bad. to, right? Yeah. It did come down to, like, he hit my Thanos. I got to copy his hypersonic. It ran across the board. Thanos on oh. his last click. And uh, I pull up with the hypersonic. Four, yeah. And I need a seven. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to attack. He rolls his shape change. And right after that, I was like, wait. I could have tried to break away with Militant to get the Hydra minus one as defense. And then I needed a seven. I rolled a six. And I was just like, oh! Like, oh, no! <laughs> Dude, it was brutal. That's the worst. It was such a good game, it. though, because oh, was, after that crit pulse wave, it was, it was like, so okay, I'm in back this. And forth, so That's good. That's yeah, a fun game. It was a really fun yeah. match. So crazy. I think, like, my biggest mistake of that game was my uh, Thor and Avengers picks. I went with high yeah. team ability. When you did that, I was like, okay. I should have <laughs> I should have either gone for Thanos or Doom. Mm -hmm. I, I should have just like soloed in on one of them with like, those yeah. abilities. But I was like, there's more Hydra guys. Yeah. And I, at I that don't point, blame you for like, picking yeah. it, but when you did, I was like, I'm kind of glad he did. Yeah. I think if I was in your shoes, I'd be heavily considering it. Well, and if yeah. I picked Doom, he's just going to ignore it with Pulse Wave for the most part. 
If I picked Thanos, that would have been like, maybe it would have swung the game a little more in my favor, but I really didn't attack him that much with mm. those guys, so... No, not really. And for a while, they were like, Captain America, or Captain Marvel and Thanos were going back and forth and just missing. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, there was, I think, Thanos had to take, like, an additional two actions to kill Captain Marvel, so... Also, it on was tough. Captain Marvel and Thor, I didn't take more than one action token for the first three turns. I <laughs> yeah, just willpower. Three willpowers, willpowers in a row. Willpower. Dang, on both. Dang. It was like a five, yeah. a five. So like, what did you walk yes. away with, Simeon? Uh, yes, so for winning the day. Well, I, I came in second oh, really? overall. Oh, darn. So I did have a winning Who record. Who won then, Luke? Um, Luke won. I, I think, think Luke did win on guess. points, yeah. So I, I don't know what his points ended up being. I ended up the day at like... I don't know, 700-ish. But uh, I got the Ghost Goblin team-up card Love and that. the Loki legacy card from Mutant Mayhem. I actually have this Loki. I'm excited to test him cool. out. And I don't have this Ghost Goblin. Hopefully he's in here. Yeah. Which we'll get to. We, might, we might pull him. <laughs> and what'd you get, Ian? Uh, I did not win, actually, because I went 2-1. Uh, but this but Luke, uh, he got first place okay. or fellowship or something. So he got a legacy card pack as well. He got the King Killmonger team-up, which... Is interesting. The fact that it's a Wakanda keyword, though, it's like, how good is this really going to be used? Again? Sure. Like, it to me, this looks like just worse Genesis, because it's, uh, if he's mm. on a Wakanda or Masters of Evil team, they can use Blades. If they can already use Blades, when they do increase the damage dealt by one, like, that's oh, just sure, Genesis. That is just Genesis, Genesis yeah. yeah. So, like, and also, it's like, why would you not want to, like, swap this guy out? So, this, to me, feels yeah. like it's not great. But this he's is, strong. like, literally the worst legacy card ever. Oh, yeah. Both, like, sculpt-wise, and just, like... Oh, this Nick Fury. Nick Fury. Looking at his face on here is like, uh, wow. Yeah, if we can get a close up on that, we will. I'll Speaking see if faces. it's even worth uh, it to take the time. Oh, boy. Yeah. Is that Boris the Animal? Oh. Then we bought two more packs. Men in Black 3, Boris the Animal. Super Adaptoid. But I mean, you can't be mad. Like, between our table, you know, getting two chases and then a Super Rare and then wow, an additional a attack super and a Super Adaptoid. Prime Thor, who Prime turned into instantly Chase, traded Thor. For Chase Thor. Chase Thor. Uh, it was a great day. It was a lot of fun. Was good. good clicks, and then yeah, also honestly, doesn't have flight. If you guys pull this, he's totally Strange not flying on his sculpt yeah. either. He's just kind of hopping forward. He's, he's so like lame. Phoenix he's really Force funny. Power. Yeah, he can't fly around. around. Godhood. All right, uh, let's just go down the line. Simi, you want to start with our legacy card as we crack into this brick here? Yes. I'm really excited. We haven't seen Avengers Prime Legacy in any of our possessions yet, and that's what I really want. So it's I like, hope so, man. Cross. Let's get another Ghost Goblin team up. I really want oh that God. team up, man. All it's right. so fun, dude. Do we want to start with the team, team up, up first? Team oh, up yeah, first. team up first. Oh. It's going to be oh. Oh. oh, okay. okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. So, Money. Pretty solid. Really good team, team up. up. Yeah. yeah. Out of all of them, probably one of the better ones. Ooh. And the Legacy. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh, oh, okay. Man, Iron Man War Machine. Dude, that right guy on. the Avengers. Prime. I did so. Did I, every time I see the back of theirs, because yeah. they got it earlier when it's all these powers, I'm like, oh, yeah. is that Avengers Prime? Damn. No, it's Iron Man War Machine. That's still pretty cool, though. I can tell. I got Iron yeah, Man the fresh. only one with blue. That's blue. I think we all yeah, own that the, one. So. The blue <laughs> one. That we one. do all own this. Yeah. Yeah, I bought so much Invincible Iron Man when it came out, dude. Also, oh my gosh. He was hard to, like, similar to Hal and Sinestro, uh, hard to trade away. Let's all grab one. He was hard to trade away for whatever reason. Like, let's kick it. Off. All right. A pack battle, boys. A pack. Oh wow. The All best ones. Of packs. So yeah, okay. everyone, everyone, show off your first okay. figure. Okay. One figure at a time. One figure at a time. Oh my girl. Right away. All right. All right. I got Captain America LMD is my first. My first figure is my girl screaming Mimi. Oh my god. Right. This guy's got the touch. I got a dead dog. Oh, dead dog. that's it's next. Beyonder. Beyond. Mine is also Beyonder. That's my <laughs> second figure. Kazar. Don't Kazar. even. Oh, Quasar. Quasar. He said Quay? Quay? Oh, 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 that's really funny. Kazar. His name is Q U though. It's Quasar. Quasar. No, I've got okay. an Iron Man common. Okay. I have Hellcat and Uncommon. Also an Iron Man call. Oh, okay. What is going on here? Quick copy, my guess. Uh I don't know who I have yet. I have Oh, a rare Hulk, the Grey okay. Hulk. I have an Ultron drone. Ooh. I have Red She-Hulk. Alright, okay. boys. Last one. Vision. Ooh. Black Panther. Bow Man. <laughs> okay, that's pretty fun. Cool. Let's cool. do that again. That was pretty good, actually. I that's like that. Fun. That was wild. I also have Beyonder. <laughs> I also have Beyonder. I also have... Oh, that's hilarious. All right, well... Okay. Big money. Should be coming soon. Okay. All right. 
Yeah, the distribution on the set so far, you guys, has been fantastic. I haven't seen a dud brick yet. I no, know, not I've really. Heard of one. Yeah, no. So here's to the first. Okay, okay to the first. <laughs> no, 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 no. This this set's version <laughs> of Double Vulture. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, I see this is I know, I know. Okay, we're kicking things off hot with a Bowman. All right, I've got another common Black Panther. So my my first figure is Chase Thor. Ooh. In the pack. Yeah, <laughs> the one Simeon just traded so I, for. I, I, Calder wins there. Yeah. yeah. I've got a uh, Stinger. Uh, Luke Cage. I have Winter Soldier. Okay. Got Bats. Vision. Mm. War Machine. Uh, who is the Hellcat? Okay. Doctor Strange. Dang, that's a bang. I know. Oh my God. Got Misty Knight. Okay. Last my one last in. one is Ultron Rare. Ooh. And Ant Man. My last one is Super Adaptoid. Ooh. Very cool. Just the right. Regular, the regular super adaptation. Okay, so I love this Ultron skull. Throwing it back to uh, kind of Hammer Thor. Hammer Thor, Thor era, era, yeah. yeah. Did that. The, uh, He's not great, but Kate I'll probably play him casually. He's fun. We're what? We're one super air in right now. One uh, super yeah. air, one chase. One super air, one chase. Yeah. yeah. Right? Okay. Yeah. One super air, so. one chase. I That's I it. I haven't pulled a super air yet. Okay. Oh, All right. Could another another three. Could be. Quit handing me the bad pass, dude. <sighs> Sorry, man. <laughs> Sorry, bro. It's not my fault. You just don't got the touch. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, big time. Oh, he man. said hand me the bad packs. Big okay. Big time. Big time. Okay. Spider robot. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> uh, Monica Chang. Got Ant Man. Got an Ultron drone. The leader. Ooh. Ooh love that. Jessica Jones. Okay. We got Jocasta. It's the Stinger! Stinger. <laughs> I've got Luke Cage. Very cool, very cool. Gotta get the cards away. Thanos, my boy. Militant. I must say expressly not my boy, but related. <laughs> Abomination. Yikes. And Falcon Rare. Oh, cool. uh, I got the Uncommon Hulk. I got Crusher Creed. Hey, here's a Ooh, super rare. Nice. Okay, right Dude, on. He's so fun. I honestly really want to play that Absorbing Man. Yeah. I want last, to last booster here, gentlemen. I think Calder won the pull off uh, sure. with the chase. Don't, that is don't call it pull off. Pull I pulled off. the worst, so it has a <laughs> pull <sympathy>. off. Okay. <laughs> so this is probably let's, just another rare. Let's see what it is. Yeah, we have, well, we have two super rares so I far. It's, I think it's super rare. So it could is be a super, super rare. Okay. All right, we'll do a little one at a time here. A little Hydra Agent, a little Ooh. Black Widow, Ooh. a little Captain Marvel, a little okay. Korvac. And oh look at that, hey, a Super Rare Spider-Man. Spider hey. So all right, three Super Rares chase, really pretty cool. good break. Yeah. All right on, guys. Cool. Dang, yeah, I love that. I like that it's like a black suit too. What's yeah. that? What's the appearance on this Spider-Man? We're gonna hold you guys on Sorry, this guys. for a second. We gotta find this out. Ooh, what could it be, what could it be? I know you got this from Scott Ford. I know, dude, it's actually right there. Amazing Spider-Man 2017. I haven't read that. Um, 789. That was a lot of Spider-Man comics. This reminds so cool. me of like the the superior costume because it, it does. Oh, it's how dark it is. Shade, yeah, yeah. But I really like that. He's a lot of fun in his lower dial. Yeah, I'd say pretty solid brick overall. Chase Thor, I'm not crazy about, but super are all fantastic. Oh, at least you're, you know, you're no got prime, a better right? eyeball job. Does he have a better eyeball job? Oh, he does. <laughs> the the eyeball. Still pretty Boris the animal looking though. Yeah, that's pretty rough, you know. Is but all is. right, all right, guys, thank you so much for watching. We're going to have a ton more Avengers 60th content coming soon. More unboxings, more gameplay, so stay tuned. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell notification to know every time we upload. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Hold up. If you guys are buying the Avengers 60th oh, and sorry. you're going through the WizKids shop, please go to shop.wizkids.com and use code DIALH10, all caps, be on the screen right here, for 10% off your purchase, courtesy of DIALH. Okay, for real though, happy trail. <laughs>